below. I'm going to be uh, doing a tier list rating of Sir Stable Horses. This is an older one on a, not an older website, but an older tier list, so they don't have all the new horses. But yeah. Okay. First, we're going to go with this guy right here. If I got this horse, he's a cute little um, pony, Shinkatik pony. If I got this horse, his name would be PJ. <laughs> I don't love the animations on this breed, but I like I like this coat color. I'm gonna put it in B. Um, and I forgot <laughs> to tell you, A is uh, top of the list. A is like perfect, B is like good, C is like okay, D is like nope, if you get what I mean. And there's the Rune Runner, or uh, not Rune Runner, whatever you, this one was. I think it was something like that. Um, I like the animations on this, and I like the detail on this horse. So I think I would honestly put it at A, because everything about this horse is good. Next, we're going to go with this horse. This is an old, crusty, dusty, ugly-looking mold. Not mold. Uh, uh, horse. No, you go. what I mean. But the coat color looks exactly like my horse Zip in real life. <laughs> exactly. Like, when I mean exactly, I mean there's no freaking difference. Other than having a uh, Zip has a half-moon marking on his face. But other than that, there's literally almost no difference. Literally no difference. So, honestly, I like the coat color. I like that they were creative with having a uh, sp spotted blanket appy, uh, spotted blanket snowflake appy like Zip. And I, honestly, the animations aren't very good. I'm putting it in C because animations aren't great. It's an old horse. But the only reason why it isn't in D is because it has. I, I like its coloring. Immediately to D, not even talking about it. These three quarter horses. Wildfire right there, I own him. That's Wildfire. Thank you, boy. Uh, these three. I really like all three of these. I like the dapple, uh, the dapple, dapple, that just sounds wrong. The dappling on this, uh, bay. I like, I do really like the Flippet and Gray, and I love the Roan about it. I love all three of these. Animations are juicy. Then there's these old paint horses. Yeah. Nope. Not doing, not even talking. Now, these guys look like, these, uh, Akeltex. I know how to pronounce it. I'm just not doing very well today, mentally. Uh, these guys, uh, the Akeltex look like giraffes. Some of the coat colors on them I like, some of them I don't. Honestly, I think I would put them in C. Andalusians. This, uh, the gray Andalusian, that, uh, this one right here, is quite beautiful. It's kind of basic, just having a gray horse, but I'm glad it's not all random cool colors and not just any basic ones. I like the animations on this. I don't love the animations, I like them. Uh, I personally like the Andalusian, too. It's a great dressage horse, and I think the gray is great for dressage, so I'm putting it in into B. The old Andalusians, of course, crusty, musty, dusty. Boom. Not even talking about that one. Now here's the Gen 2 Arabians, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, Gen 2. I like the Gen 2 Arabian slash Pentavians. They're, as you can see, their coat is a little glossy and too shiny. It's really odd. But, uh, and they also, they kind of look like a spider which a lot of people say, which I see where they're coming from, because I understand what animations that they're talking about. Part of the animations. It's Im almost impossible for everybody to explain, but we all get where we're all where uh, each of us are coming from, saying it's a spider. But for some reason, I kind of like them. And everybody's about to disagree with me, but we're putting that there. <laughs> everybody hates me now. Old Arabians. Cool. Um, this ma uh, the Magic Andalusian, I also like it. It's pre quite pretty. 
and I love the new Clydesdales. I really like this black Clydesdale, too. Uh, he's Technically, he's a really, really, really dark bay, but you could still consider him black because he has some of that lighting right there. Some blacks have that, too. A lot of blacks have that, but sometimes you could technically call this horse uh, a really, really freaking dark, uh, dark bay, and you could still technically, in a way, be right. But I love this horse. I love the high stockings. Then there's this one. I kind of like their animations at times. Some of them are okay for the Connemaras. It's it's okay. I'm putting it at C because it's okay. It's okay. Now I like the curly horses. They do have some weird animations, but part of me just kind of likes them for how uh, their face is. It's unrealistic, but it still catches the eye. And for some reason, I don't know why I'm doing this, but I'm putting it in B. Nope, not even looking at that one. Old Hanover the Hanoverians, they're ugly, they look like frogs, just no. 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 Now, I love the Thoroughbreds. They don't look entirely realistic. They look cool. They look like a cart, uh, a realistic-ish cartoon idea. It isn't made to, it doesn't look like they tried to do it realistically, they tried to do it as a style, and I like the style. And I like this coat color too. The fawn, the fauna, the fawn, I forgot this one's name, but I know it's something like fawn, or deer. I mean, I like it. It just looks a, wee a little weird. Just, it's just not getting into that. Nope. Now, I love the fjords. Big fan of fjords. I love the gates. No, we're not. Now, here's the, here's like a Photoshop version of the Gen 2. Now, I like Gen 2 uh, Frisians. They're okay. They're good for dressage. Here's the, uh, the older Halflingers. I like the older Halflingers, actually. Pretty good. And I love the uh, Jorvik warm bloods in the starter horses. They look so cute. Brinicole, I think is his name. I really like him. I like his animations. I like his hairstyle. And here's the old Icelandics. I actually really like them. They do look a little crusty in some of their coats, a lot of them coats, but something about it just says Icelandic to me. Like, you could look at that breed as long as you know some, uh, as long as you know what an Icelandic looks like, you've seen one in a picture or real life, if you, uh, you could look at this and say immediately that's an Icelandic. And that's kind of what I like. Love the cobs. I like them. I like this, uh, the Yorvik pony, but their trot is a little weird. I like these two. They're okay. No. Eh. Now, I'm just gonna fly through a little bit. I can't even see. This is the Marwari. This is a really detailed photo. I like that. But that's not, I'm not gonna even, I don't wanna read that. I'm just, I'm not saying it's bad. I love this horse, but I'm putting it in D just because you can't even see the picture. Lusitano's always a good. Nope. Nope. I like the Mustangs. They're okay. Nope, not even thinking. Love these. Nope. Nope. I used to have this one. I sold it for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> Just gonna pile all these crusty beans in here. It's another gen. Shires are ugly. I love the Traconer, the Traconers or Traconers. Some people say Traconers. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but I'm pretty sure it's Traconer. Love this one. Ew. Meh. Makes sound effects. What's on? Eh. Literally just stacking. <laughs> Look at that. That's a mess. Okay, bye.